Welcome to the sitting and standing Pilates session. All you will need for this session is a kitchen or dining room chair. Start by moving yourself to the edge of your chair so you're unsupported by the backrest. Imagine a helium balloon lifting you from the crown of your head to an upright posture that feels comfortable for you. Slightly nod your chin so you feel lengthening through the back of your neck. Now take your focus to your shoulders. Gently raise your shoulders towards your ears and notice any tension. Now gently glide your shoulders towards your pelvis and notice the opening of the space between your ears and the shoulders. Shrug your shoulders forward to feel increasing space between your shoulder blades. Then take them back to feel gentle opening through the front of the chest and relax. Often people find as they start to explore these movements, they may feel tightness around the shoulders. This is perfectly normal. Bring your concentration to your breath and begin to gently slow and deepen your breathing. Place your hands on your pelvis. Imagine your pelvis as a bucket of water. Now tip the bucket back as you feel your lower back rounding and forward. Rest in a middle position that feels comfortable for you. Lateral breathing. Place your hands at the sides of your rib cage. Start to move your focus to your breathing. As you breathe in, feel your rib cage expanding into your hands and fingertips, drawing apart slightly. As you exhale, feel your fingertips coming closer together as you relax the rib cage. Resting your hands by your side, gently add some tension backwards to your lower abdominal area or by lifting gently your back passage towards your heart. Dumb waiter. Bend the elbow to 90 degrees with the palms facing upwards towards the ceiling. Breathe in and as you breathe out, start to turn your lower arms out, registering the position of the shoulder blades. Feel length between your ears and your shoulder blades throughout the movement. Breathe in as you return to the starting position. Stay at this level or if you'd like to progress, as you turn your arms away, lengthen the arms away from the body. Turn the palms down, then up, and return the arms back to the starting point. And repeat. Try to stay relaxed through the shoulder blades, keeping the neck long throughout the movement. Mermaid. Place one hand on a chair and sweep your palm through the air, registering a stretch through your side. Breathe in and out as you return to your starting position. And repeat to the other side. As you perform this exercise, make sure to move and arrange that feels comfortable for you. You may find it helpful to bend your supporting arm to facilitate the movement. Arms opening. Raise your arms to shoulder height with your palms facing in. Keeping your buttocks rested on the chair, breathe in and then as you breathe out, float your right arm round to the side, looking at your fingertips as you go and return. 
Repeat to the other side. Try to facilitate the rotation by leading with your chest bone. Breathing out to stretch and breathing in to return. and relax. Take a moment to set your standing position. Stand with feet hip width apart by opening the toes and following with the heels. Imagine a helium balloon lifting you from the crown of your head and a gentle nod through your chin to feel the length at the back of your neck. Place your hands on your pelvis, tipping forward and backward before resting into your comfortable middle position. And relax your arms. Toy soldier. With your knees soft and your arms resting by your body, inhale, start to explore raising and lowering one arm at a time, making sure to move in your comfortable available range. Register your shoulder position as you go through the exercise to maintain a sense of space between your ears and your shoulders. And relax. Foot pedal. Place your hands on your pelvis, maintaining your neutral pelvis. Lift and lower one heel at a time while staying in a central position. You can use a chair for balance if more support is needed. You may wish to come up onto your tiptoes and continue exploring this movement, alternately lowering one heel at a time. For more of a coordination challenge, try raising your opposite arm and heel, lowering together and repeating on the opposite side. Roll down. Soften your knees, lengthen through your spine. Breathe in, and as you breathe out, start to take your chin towards your chest and slowly start to flex through your spine, vertebrae by vertebrae from your upper back, rib cage, lower back. Only lower as far as you feel comfortable, and you may extend this further down your legs as you warm up if this is comfortable. Tucking your tailbone in, building your spine from the lower, middle, and upper back, shoulders resting towards your pelvis. Breathe in at your lowest point, wherever that is, and then you can breathe out slowly, restacking your spine. Bring the focus back to your breath, and I invite you to take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. Repeat once more. 